Okay, so I'm sitting here with my prayer warriors, and we're just flipping through Brandy's Bible because it is loaded in gold dust. And she woke up with it and got it this morning. So, Brandy, can you tell us a little bit about what's going on with your Bible? She has several passages to choose from. Starting well, in... Okay. Okay, so I'm going to zoom in on that. This is 2 Corinthians 10, 4. Okay. Speak up. Let me read it. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> the weapons we fight with are not weapons of the world. On the contrary, they have divine power to demolish strongholds. We demolish arguments and every pretension that sets itself up against the knowledge of God. And we take captive every thought and to make it obedient to Christ. Amen. Okay, so that was one passage that was highlighted. Was that something you were praying about, Brandy? This passage, yes. Okay. But... Let's see. I'm, there's one in, in Acts. Okay. And this is Brandy. And this this Bible, Bible hasn't been opened mm -hmm. in a month. Wow. I mean, it hasn't. I used it. You gave it back to me. I put it away because it's kind of... Mm -hmm. Second Acts 2, 17. I will pour out my spirit on all people. Your sons and daughters will prophesy. Your young men will see visions. Your old men will dream dreams. Even on my servants, both men and women, I will pour out my spirit in those days. And they will prophesy. I will show wonders in the heaven above and signs on the earth below. Blood and fire and billows of smoke. The sun will be turned, into, turned to darkness and the moon to blood before the coming of the great and glorious day of the Lord. And everyone who calls on the name of the Lord will be saved. Hallelujah. Okay, awesome. How about uh, Psalm 91? You want to go there? We don't have to read that one. Psalm 91 is something that we very often pray over protection over each other, and we've prayed it over Brandy a lot. And this, it's loaded. It's loaded in her Bible. Just affirmation. God's hearing the prayer. And he is the God of protection. Okay, where are you now? Psalm 85, 9. This starts with verse 2. Guard my life, for I am devoted to you. You are my God, save your servant who trusts in you. Have mercy on me, O Lord, for I call to you all day long. Bring joy to your servant, for to you, O Lord, I lift up my soul. <clears throat> you are forgiving and good, O Lord, abounding in